Sal's being interviewed, and Sal has this weird thing. I, I call it, he goes into stockbroker mode. <laughs> Sal just starts so talking. He, Sal hates that term because his wife agrees with me. Yeah. Then he goes into this weird zone yeah. where he just starts saying words, and they don't mean anything. And then the key ingredient is insincerity. Yeah. So Sal's <laughs> going to talk about how it's positivity and how he loves horses. But why am I insincere? Why, Gary? You, well, listen to yourself. That's All right, why. let's hear the clip. Here we go, guys. Well, if you don't know who Sal the Turtle is, the two-legged version is right here. Um, Sal Governale from the Howard Stern Show. I mean, I've talked to you before, but right. Jeff Bloom named this horse after you. Right. And uh, he's the favorite here. Is that because you're here? Sal the turtle is the favorite. I mean, I, I can't believe that. I, I, for once in my life, I'm at a loss of words. I mean, my horse is the favorite, thanks to Jeff Bloom and Bloom Stables. I'm so excited. You know what I think it is? I think it's like just like the power of positivity. It's just the vibes and the goodness. Some people bet on names. Some people bet on numbers. We bet on love. And Sal the turtle <laughs> is all about love. He's got a lot of spirit. He has a lot of heart. He is what I consider to be our modern day sea biscuit, you know? Oh, that's a lofty comparison, I'd say. Well, I just saw the movie yesterday. I'm just <laughs> catching up on my her horse stuff, you know, my horse history. Right. Yeah. I know a little bit about its secretariat, then the sea biscuit, and I'm thinking oh to myself, my God. then it's going to be Sal the turtle. Oh, Gary, he just rambled. <laughs> Gary's a, no, but I'm saying he he just he just talks for the sake of talking, right. and he just he, he. What did he even say? He, that he has Robin. This, what did he say? I don't know. Is it just that you feel you have to fill up time? No, <laughs> I'll tell you what you the know problem what you are? is. You're a professional bullshitter. Yeah. Uh, no, I'll tell you what the problem is. I'll tell you what the problem is, Howard. Gary, you pulled the lame clip. No, it's just not a good not lame at all. <laughs> as a producer, <laughs> nice, nice try, Sal. As Everyone, a producer, the he clip, pulled the right clip. The right it was clip. just it was you embarrassed the show. Yes. It was a stand. Ooh. No, I didn't. It was a standard interview. Why I is was, it these we other don't shows? Even know what you're talking <laughs> first of all, I mean, I'm talking about a horse. They asked on. me about a horse. I said it's about positivity. First of all, what's wrong with that? Everybody's so fucking negative in this world. I know what he did. This is the only show where you can be positive and you're still a shithead. He vamps for 20 seconds in the beginning of that clip, so he comes up with some bullshit, and then he sort of comes up with positivity and rolls. I don't even think he knows what the question was. I mean, do you really love horses as much as you say in that clip? Yeah, I do. I grew up with horses. I what mean, do you mean you grew up with horses? You grew track. up with Hicksville. Well, There's no horses. Well, he watched them on TV. <laughs> oh, no. My dad used to take me to the OTB and to the track. <laughs> oh, oh, you're not growing up with horses. You well, grew you know up with my... degenerate gambling. <laughs> <laughs>